officer's choice. I got us at least I promise to heal her. Sorry, Mark. I thought you were dead, man. Oh well. Let your memory live on forever. And uh, probably next time I'll probably I'll probably give one of those uh uh what did they call um like they did from I thought what happened in Star Force number three. And nobody didn't die. Well, this one did. At least I can make a little funeral for him. It'd be nice of me. Well, nice for him, I mean. I mean, it's quite sad, really. I'm having his, uh, well, At least she'll escape. At least Cindy will escape the rapture. I hope that's enough for you, man. What's this? I remember. This is where they bound us together, Father. Praying God. You were the only good thing that Rapture ever gave me. This was my origin. My birth. Same process that Markster did. Lamb, we'll pay for this. Breaking an, a good bond between father and daughter. I hope you burn it out. She was not meant to have a father, Delta. She was to be an heir to my life's work. And this is where they changed her. Bonding her to you. The child she was died in this room. Well, I wasn't the one who killed a good friend, monster. <laughs> Damn it, I ran out of hack darts. You'll pay for what you did to. Mark, man, you're gonna pay big time, Lamb. Just you wait. No, I need some darts so I can get into the. Oh, yeah, there was a weapons vendor in the back. Back there. Maybe if I can just... For Mark, man. <laughs> all this, all this was my doing in the beginning. I gave Lamb power. All this chaos was my doing. I created this nightmare when I killed Frank Fontaine. 
I created this monster. So I should be the one to finish it. Finish this. One way or another. One of us will die tonight. By the end of the by the end I will have my vengeance on you, Lamb. For Mark. So that's three down, one more to go. And the last one's at the bottom of these cages. I think, I think it's a cage. Wait. 